I'm going to well, see. we're back for another episode of the baby calves. We put the little red one with his mother yesterday, and then we decided to uh, put him up last night because it's cold. So we're coming back this morning. We're going to get him and take him back to his mother and go ahead and turn them out since last night was the last single digit night. So here we go. Well, now we're going to catch that 20 cal and we're going to make it another attempt today. We're going to push this bunch out. He can go. Yeah. Oh, Come with me. Where are you going? Huh? Where are you going? We're just going to push these cows out. Blue, hold your horses. You get to going too fast, too hard, and then you get everything upset. Now let's just try to take it easy. Let's take it easy and push today. Come on. Come on, girl. Blue. Good dog. Yeah. Good puppy. Bring me a couple back. Bring me a couple back. Stay close to the fence and get ready to climb it. Bring her. Get on up there. What, Dad? <coughs> yeah, bring her. There you go. Bring her. Yeah, watch out. Here it comes Tony. Watch out, boys. Whoa! Oh, stayed right in the cow patty. Hurry up and shut the gate! She's trying to climb the fence. Hold this, Rocket. Here. Let me see you. My goodness. Damn, she's hard on stuff. All right, we gotta get these out of here so we can get her in the damn squeezer. She's so crazy. What? We'll get it. Don't get depressed. Don't get negative thinking. We're going to get it. Unless she breaks down the gate first. Come on, girls. Come on. Push her. Not yet! 
Somebody's got to run the head gate. Oh, wow. Well, we got it. Yeah, let's go get the tail. Oh, Why in the hell can she not get up? What is your deal? Can she get up? No. I don't know what the. Now she's got a foot caught. <clears throat> Hell, I'm gonna have to let her out. Watch out, boys, cause she's... Wow. Well, we had a failed attempt. Attempt at the uh, milk and 20. So, as you can see, she would like to jump over everything. And she's crazy. She kept getting down in the chute. I don't think it would have worked anyway. Not the way she'd get down and I'd have to let her out and try to run her back through there four or five times before she's going to get to smell this calf on good enough, I'd imagine. And by the second attempt of trying to get her in a squeeze chute, I don't think it worked very good anyway. So probably just as well she got out before somebody hey. got hurt. So we'll just have to bottle feed this little squirt. Hey, he's hungry. He's hungry, so we're going to get to it. There you go. He's hungry this morning. Yeah. You want to feed him, Rocket? Right. If you're going through it, and I'm going through it, and we're all three walking through it, and you watch me have to open it, then you better be, if you're the last one, you chain it shut. That way we don't have any of those problems, because when I came back to it, I had no idea, wasn't thinking that that gate was open. That's how fast things happen. You know? Because Rocket was probably thinking, well, what's the point of shutting it? We've got her in the squeeze chute. But then plans changed just about that fast, didn't they? Mm -hmm. So it's better just to be safer than sorry and just go ahead and shut the gates. Mm -hmm.